So this is just what I've been thinking about lately. Producer versus an artist. Now an artist, they tend to be the people that go out there, make songs, perform the songs. And the producer, he goes out there to make the songs also. The only difference between a producer and an artist, I feel like, is that there's more money in on the production side than there is an artist side. The main reason why I say that, and the main reason why I think that, is because, look, selling tickets nowadays is impossible. It's really freaking difficult. The last show, last local show that I got to, maybe 20 people showed up to that show. And it was $10 a ticket. So if 20 people showed up, they made 200 that night. Now, you have to pay every artist that's on the show. You also got to pay the promoter, pay the place that uh, you're renting to perform the show. On top of that, low streaming rates in music stores these day and age, such as Spotify. Where's the money in it? Meanwhile, Meanwhile, as a music producer or audio engineer or whatever you want to call it, I'm able to put out 100 songs if I really wanted to. If I had enough clientele, enough people wanting to work with me, I could put out 100 songs. And I could use that to help garner me passive income. Just as, just as a YouTube channel, just as anything like that. But now like with the business models, I talked about this earlier, business models of these music streaming is that you have all of this money added up in a month that they pay out by the percentage of the streams that you picked up. So now with 100 songs a month, what's that, 1,200 songs in a year? And all of that is fighting for attention. It's fighting for streams. And that's how you could get your streams at. And let's say you can take a low cut, low percentage, let's say 20% of all the songs. That's 20% unless it gets a million plays. 20% of four grand. It's not a lot of money, but it's better than being an artist. Because like an artist, for real though, like, I feel like they're just not gonna go anywhere. Unless you're like freaking huge. And the percentage of people, artists, Getting huge is slim. And everybody needs a producer. Everybody that needs needs an audio engineer. Like even the people that play guitar or drums. They're not gonna understand what how to EQ it, how to set the mics up. They're not gonna understand this shit. But anyways.